Hey everybody, welcome to another edition of Probia TV. My name is Martin and I'm doing now one of my very rare um, beer reviews in English. There's a good reason for that because uh, today's beer comes from Rogue Ales from Newport in Oregon and I'm currently planning a trip to uh, the region of uh, Rogue Ales to Newport and I contacted the brewery and uh, was asking whether I can visit the brewery, if somebody can take me around. And Rogue Ale is so helpful to me at the moment. Thank you very much guys uh, at Rogue Ale for your help. Um, and for my viewers, of course, I will uh, shoot some footage there, show you the world of Rogue Ales. And they invited me to their farm in Independence uh, and I'm hopefully we'll be shooting there as well. Uh, how the hop grows uh, and how they do the malt and all that stuff. Maybe I can get behind the secret of uh, Pac-Man yeast, which of course was also used in the Rogue Ale 7 Hops uh, IPA, which I'm reviewing today. Um, it's 7.77 uh, uh, ABV with seven hops that are grown on um, the Rogue Farm. It's um, Liberty, Newport, Revolution, Rebel, and Independent, Freedom and Alluvial. Hops I've never heard before, um, except in this beer, um, but it seems that this uh, hop is grown uh, on their own farm, so it's their own hops. Maybe uh, for us it seems like experimental hops, but it definitely isn't. It's a double IPA, at, uh, it comes at 18 Plato and uh, 76 IBU, so it's gonna be a bitter experience I'm facing. So, nice rogue cap on the top. And let's see what we get. Wow. Oh, uh, continue. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I was so happy about the smoke coming out of the beer. That I'm spilled some of it. Oh, pardon me. Wow. I can get the aroma right here, but let's get to the beer first. Nice one finger of white, fine foam, nice lacing on the glass. And wow, what an orange amber color. Hazy, but look at that color. That's a really nice IPA, 7.77 ABV. Nice citrusy start. That's what I was getting when I was opening the beer that spilled all over my kitchen. Sorry. Tropical fruit, some pine, caramel. Yeah, that's basically it. So let's dive into this one. Cheers. Wow, 76 IBU, they are not hiding. Right from the first sip, you get the bitterness from this beer. But um, on the other hand, it's, it has a like, like honey sweetness. Um, it's a little bit brady um, and lots of fruit. Uh, ananas, orange, dry fruit. Wow, that's nice. A little bit resin. But the bitterness is awesome. It's so well balanced with this, um, with this uh, honey sweetness on the one side and the bitterness on the other side. But still you get the bitterness, but it's not um, completely uh, taking you the taste. It's just so well balanced in this beer. And you get all the aromas Wow, that's a really good one. I've had this one before, but it was from the big bottle and it was, I think it was one in the one, 110th, 120th video I did. And the 
the body um, it's a medium sized body um, the carbonation is um, not too 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 aggressive um, it's rather creamy uh, fine bubbles and yeah it's getting a little bit drier in the end the pine comes comes out a little uh, a lot more on this one and also the honey goes so the 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 bitterness uh, gets up front and um, it seems to be a little bit drier in the end citrusy is still there but uh, the bitterness plays the major role uh, in the aftertaste of this beer wow that's an IPA uh, of my taste and I really really look forward to have this one from um, from the tap as we here in Europe only get it from the bottles this bottle um, actually was uh, given to me by uh, One Pint Germany thank you One Pint guys uh, for sending me over this bottle I appreciate that very much um, they they do a lot of uh, great imports at, at One Pint Germany so um, I have uh, some more bottles from them um, but uh, the Rogue uh, 7 Hop IPA is really a great one so let's give it a rating Rock se Rogue 7 Hops IPA um, it's gonna be four and a half points by ProBeer TV for the Rocks 7 Hops IPA. Please subscribe to uh, my channel, uh, then you get uh, every beer review I do. You get all the trip reports that I will be doing in September. You get the impressions from the Rogue Farm, so it's a good reason to press the subscribe button. Thank you very much. Have a good night, have a good morning, whatever you watch, and uh, see you next time here at ProBeer TV. See you. Cheers.